the Romantic Age, 1798 to 1837, which gave the wealth of poems to English literature, began to the end of the 18th century with the publication of Lyrical Ballads in 1798 by two poets, Wordsworth and Coleridge. This romantic age saw the successions of King George IV, William IV, and ended with the succession of the Queen Victoria. French Revolution and the American Revolution, which paralleled the progress of Romantic Age, made an impact on writers of this age. Industrialization in England during this era caused revolts like Luddite riots. The rise of working class and the revolution against governments around the world led to the Peterloo Massacre in England. Hence, the Romantic Age is also called the Age of Revolution. Romantic writers were against to the writing style and standard set by the neoclassical writers. Romantic writers believed in spontaneity and individuality. The poets of the Romantic Age are classified into the first generation poets and the second generation poets. William Blake, William Wordsworth, Samuel Taylor Coleridge, Robert Southey were the first generation poets as they were impacted by the French Revolution. The French Revolution had ended by the time of the second generation poets started writing and they were impacted by the other revolutions like the Peterloo Massacre in England and the second generation poets are Lord Byron, Percy Bysshe Shelley and John Keats. Gothic novel was a famous genre of novels in this romantic age. They were written by Anne Radcliffe, Matthew Gregory Louis and Mary Shelley but William Godwin, Fanny Burney, Mary Edgeworth Walter Scott and Jane Austen were famous novelists of this age. Mary Wollstonecraft's Vindication of the Rights of Women, written in this era, is considered as the earliest feminist text in the English literature. The political controversy between the Whigs and the Tories led to the establishment of various magazines like the Edinburgh Review, the Quarterly Review, the London Magazine and others. The famous prose contributors of this era are Charles Lamb, William Hazlitt, Thomas De Quincey and Thomas Law Peacock.